We are going to extract composition root into separate classes. Hello, my friends, again. We have learned in the previous video how to separate the services from the logic, the main UI logic, and put them into a standalone class. And this class is my application, which extends application. But think about if you have a real app, and this app, when it is increased, and when it is having many logic to do, the services instances will increase too. And this will make and affects the application performance because we are using the my application uh, class. So for that, I, we need to make uh, simple, uh, simple changes. I need to uh, separate this code, just cut and paste them into a new class, standalone class, and we make, uh, we make a, uh, a standalone class that will uh, make uh, these calls and these, uh, make these instances one instance from this. For that, I will create a new package called dependency injection, and we will use the it later on injection and inside this package i will create a new class called composition compo composition root and in this class will maybe will be as a ui thread also and I will cut and paste this code. So private, stack overflow, and till here. I will cut it. I will cut the whole, cut it, and paste it inside the composition root. Okay, and I will make this private in order to not allowing allowing the user to make or the app to make more and more instances from the stack overflow api or the retrofit okay and inside the my class my application inside my application i will make a composition private increasing the size private composition root composition root and on create i will override the on create sorry i will override okay you can put it and we can write it directly on create i will create a constant uh, composition instance equal to new composition root instance composition root okay in this way i am decoupling all the ui all the services all the networking from uh, the, the the ui logic the, the main ui logic and the public here the constructor composition root get composition and I'm passing here the return M or composition root, okay? It's very simple, guys. What we have made is creating a, a class called uh, M root. It's here, uh, the composition root. And uh, cutting the uh, my application uh, lo uh, logic and put paste it uh, here in the composition root. And on my application is pasting like just these codes in order to prevent uh, the redundancy of a code and making an more and more uh, data and more, more and more sorry uh, codes to be accessed. And one last thing I need to make changes is inside the inside the onCreate method of the fetch uh, of the, the questions list activity and the details activity. So questions list and the questions details. 
questions details we have an error here so it, it, we can resolve it by put here get composition root also here the same way I will put get composition root so despite allowing the, the application to access directly the codes we put it from the composition root and we fetch the questions list use case and we prevent our application from making many instances by by mistake or the, the developer making or you will make a, a, an instance or new instances of retrofit or stack overflow by error so we are conserving these we are separating these the stack overflow and the retrofit instances creation from making uh, this uh, happen let's run our application and see and our uh, and our application is working smoothly so in this way we have implementing the clean architectures and designing pattern and uh, soon we will start the real dependency injection but we, we ensure that uh, our application have a very clean architecture